Hello and welcome to The Scoop, your destination for the latest in Hollywood's happenings and all things entertainment. Well, this week on The Scoop, we are unveiling all sorts of juicy gossip and financial rumors. We have the details on the Ashton and Demi marital mess, as well as a photo of the temptress Ashton is accused of cheating with. On Scooped or Duped, we find out if Kim K is already having a new little Kardashian, and who in Hollywood has landed a real-life prince. Speaking of royalty, Hollywood gave birth to a new royal couple this weekend. See who's getting the shaft and less pay for the same work on the silver screen and how Hep's former fiance is making the ultimate comeback. All that and more today on The Scoop. I'm Joseph Shepard. And I'm Lola Fernandez. Donald Trump can never be accused of not being creative. His business ideas, his hair, any way you look at it, the man has ideas. His latest business breakthrough came in the form of a marketing campaign. Donald Trump's Atlantic City Taj Mahal Casino is marketing a $25,000 plastic surgery giveaway in the month of October. Card holders who win can choose plastic surgery procedures up to $25,000 or for those who feel that don't need the work, they can ask for the amount in cash. The contest is receiving some mild flack for mixing two very compulsive behaviors, gambling and plastic surgery. But I doubt Trump will care what people are saying. This man has been working the comb over for decades. The big news this week is all about the relationships. Ashton Kutcher and Demi Moore reported to be calling it quits after allegations that Ashton spent the sixth anniversary of their nuptials betting a 23-year-old party girl, Sarah Leal. It seems to have all taken place at the Two and a Half Men Stars Hard Rock Hotel Suite in Las Vegas. It would seem Charlie Sheen's old show isn't all Ashton has picked up. And this isn't the first time Ashton has been accused of infidelity. Remember the Brittany Jones allegations the couple claimed were not true? Well, like Brittany, Sarah is confirming she slept with Kutcher and she is willing to tell all for $250,000 or say nothing at all for $250,000 from Ashton personally. The couple hasn't confirmed or denied the split, but those close to Demi say that it is true. And if that isn't enough for you, Ashton and Demi stopped following each other on Twitter last week. Well, on to a happier note, Seth Rogen married girlfriend of seven years, Lauren Miller, in a Sunday ceremony in Sonoma, California's wine country. The three-day ceremony and reception came this past weekend when Rogen's new film, 5050, premiered. Producer, director Judd Apatow and wife Leslie Mann were among those in attendance along with Jonah Hill and Adam Sandler. The ceremony was full of laughs and it was so lovely. No thanks to Rogan, who couldn't even plan a proper proposal, having asked Miller in their closet while she was topless.